Hi, nice to meet you. My name is Eric Franklin, and I'm excited to tell you about my upcoming Netherlands tour, uh, where you're going to learn how the pelvis actually absorbs force uh, to give you more power and movement, and also how to liberate your hip joints through that knowledge. And also, did you know that the psoas is actually four muscles, and they actually have quite different function? We need to understand that if we want to save our backs and our clients, of course. Then I'm going to show you at least 35 ways to relax your shoulders and release your neck. Uh, we're going to look at how the feet, how human feet can survive an average of walking around the planet four times in a lifetime. Then we're going to understand rib cage and breathing dynamics. And for example, that your abdominal muscles really evolve for breathing and that has a big significant um, a bit of um, information for how to train your abdominals. Then did you know that jaw alignment directly influences your spinal alignment and vice versa? So lots of juicy interesting things coming up. So here we continue through the slides. This is me teaching at the Juilliard School in New York. We'll be using some props, uh, bands and balls. Always good to organize our bodies, create more strength. Isn't this a fun picture right here? This is one of the Franklin Method classics, the pelvic geyser. So we're definitely going to increase our pelvic power. And then, of course, we need to understand um, how the bones move so we can really understand the muscles. Here we see a little bit of uh, transversus abdominis and rectus um, abdominis interaction. So as they're hidden in the background, here an example of some of the um, very effective pelvic floor exercises we're going to do. You can see the adductors how they relate to the pelvic floor. Then here comes the psoas. This picture is great because it really shows you how the diaphragm is related to the psoas and uh, how that interacts, especially those crews there at the back, and how that also interacts with digestion because part of the diaphragm there loops around the esophagus. Then this is one of the images we're going to use. Um, it's a counterbalancing image through different layers of size. It's going to really help your back. Then, as I promised, lots of good things to help your shoulders. Also, things that work really fast for people who aren't so experienced using imagery. For example, this one here, little imaginary balloons lifting your clavicles. So you can really release your arms downward. Then our feet. Lots of secrets will be revealed here. Uh, foot dynamics, so we can understand how, for example, the plantar aponeurosis relates to um, an extension action in our toes, a fundamental invention um, of human evolution. Then, of course, how the ribs gyrate and move to create optimal spinal movement and optimal breathing. And then, of course, the jaw, secrets of organizing, releasing the jaw, and just feeling better also in your neck and your whole body. So, looking forward to seeing you. The time to register is now. Go to the website and let's have a wonderful time while learning a whole lot of stuff. Okay, see you then. Bye.